Hey everybody, Redneck in a Hat. Today, um, got my lawnmower out here. Um, anyway, I, I got a new uh, battery maintainer for it for this next winter. And I only use it throughout the summer, you know. Sometimes it might go a week or two without mowing. And it's got a new battery in it. I want to make sure that this battery stays up. Today's the day we're making the big switch from Time Warner. We're switching over to Google Fiber. Um, gonna check out this internet. That's more important than anything to me is just having the internet. Um, there's a lot of you can do on the internet, but uh, this Google Fiber been uh, curious for a long time on what it's like, how good it is, is it what people say it is, and uh, so we're kind of excited to uh, try it out. But uh, the guy's supposed to be here later today and uh, get us all fixed up. Well, the Google Fiber guy has got us hooked up, got the modem down, plugged into the wall, um, got the computer turned on, and we're gonna see how it does on YouTube. Well, I'm, I like it. Seems to work for me. Uh, it loaded it pretty quick. Um, plays it. No glitches. Um, we'll just have to see on uploads. And uh, it's supposed to be pretty fast at it. He said no problem for uh, a YouTube creator. Um, so We now return to your regular programming. We've got a battery tender. It's a power tender plus um, battery charger maintainer. Um, this was made by uh, Deltran. It's one of the better ones out there, the battery tender brand. It's a brand you can trust on your battery, whether you're putting it on a, a car that's in storage and uh, you want to make sure the battery stays up, you know, over time. You know, if it's sitting weeks or months at a time, put one of these on it. I'm going to put this on uh, my Cub Cadet lawnmower. It's 12 volt, 5.0 amp. This this charger does uh, maintain. It kicks on and off. It keeps your battery charged up. It also comes with the plug you uh, put this on your battery, on your vehicle or lawnmower, motorcycle, whatever you're going to be using this on. You put this on your battery, leave it on there. Um, it's got a little weather cap, safety cap here that covers the, the plug. Keep dirt, grease from getting on it. When you go to use it, just take the cap off and it plugs. And this is the cord coming from the charger. I just plug in. Um, if you got this hanging down underneath the hood, you don't even have to pop the hood. You just pull the cap off, plug it in. No more messing with the battery. Things you're probably going to need. One, you're going to need a wrench for your battery to take the uh, nut off the battery or the bolt. And you're going to probably need a couple of zip ties to uh, fasten the cord just so it's not flopping and uh, you can fasten it where you want it and it'll stay there with a couple of zip ties. Here's the lawnmower we're going to be uh, putting this on. It's a, a Cub Cadet LT 1050. It's a little older one. Alright, I got my wrench, got my zip ties. We're going to take the uh, battery connectors loose.
Now this is color coded, one red, one black. You want to put your red on the red positive. And you want to put your black on the black negative. how simple it is to put the, the short lead on your battery. Now to uh, find where I want to tie this down to. I'm probably gonna I'm probably gonna want to hook it up on this side just because that's probably the side my charger will be coming from. That way my line don't they have to come all the way over. You want to make sure your cable isn't going to be caught on anything. No moving parts. Come down the frame here. You want to make sure it's not around anything that's going to get hot, like exhaust, muffler, part of the motor. Now we got we got the lawnmower wired. Um, I'm gonna plug it in, make sure it works. First, you want to plug your vehicle or battery into the charger before you even turn the power source on. So unplug your cap, plug plug it in. Then last. You plug it into electricity. Don't plug it into electricity first. That's hard on your charger. All right, now that we got it plugged into electricity, yellow light. Um, it shows it's charging. Now this, you can mount this on the wall of your garage. Um, I don't know that that's what I'll do because I may want to move it around uh, depending on where uh, my lawnmower is going to be at from one year to the next. So I probably won't um, fasten it to a wall. But anyway, this is all it is to it. Like I say, you can hook this up to a motorcycle, lawnmower, um, a generator battery, um, anything that's got a battery, even a car. Uh, keeps your battery from going dead and ruining a good battery. A new battery can go dead and it can be ruined just because it, it, something drained the power on it. Anyway, thanks for watching. Redneck and a half.